Wahiguru Ji Ka Khalsa, Wahiguru Ji Ki Fateh Hukum Nama Sahib today is by Guru Ram Das Ji Maharaj in Jayat Sari Ragni Wahiguru Ji Jayat Sari Mahala Chautha Karu Pahala Chaupade Ek Oankar Sate Gaur Prasade Mere Here Ratan Naam Hare Basya गोरे हाथ तरियो मेरे माथा जन्म जन्म के किल बिख दुख उतरे गोरे नाम दियो रेन लाथा मेरे हियर रतन नाम हरे बसिया गोरे हाथ तरियो मेरे माथा जन्म जन्म के किल बिख दुख उतरे गोरे नाम दी ओर न लाथा मेरे मन भज राम नाम सब अर्था गोरे पूरे हर नाम दृढ़ाया बिन नावे जीवन बिरथा रहाओ बिन गुर मूड भए है मन मुख ते मोह माया नित फाथा तिन साधु चरण न सेवे कबहु तिन सब जन्म अकाथा जिन साधु चरण साध पग सेवे तिन सफलियो जन्म सनाथा मुकाओ की जय दास दास दासन को हर दया तार जगनाथा हम अंतुले ज्ञान हीन अज्ञानी क्यों चल है मार्ग पंथा हम अंतुले को गुर अंचल दीजे जन नानक चल है मिलंथा हम अंतुले ज्ञान हीन अज्ञानी क्यों चल है मार्ग पंथा हम अंतुले को गुर अंचल दीजे जन नानक चल है मिलंथा सतगुरु रामदास जी महाराज ब्लेसिंग अस डे जय श्री रागणी महाराज सच्चे पादशाह सोडी सुल्तान Satguru Ram Das Ji Maharaj blesses us in the Kar Pahla, the first house of rhythm and beat. Satguru Maharaj Ji's Shabbat is in Chau Pade. Pade meaning feet, Chau meaning four. Four parts to the Shabbat. And Satguru Maharaj Sahib Ji begins with the Mangala Charna with the introduction Ik O Ankar. Satgura Prasad This is the first Shabbat of the Jat Sri Ragni and with this Satguru Maharaji begins this Mangala Chane Kuanka Satgura Prasad there is one eternal Lord God Vaheguru who is found through the Prasad the grace of the Guru Satguru Prasad Satguru Maharaj Sahib begins the Shabbat Mera Hira Ratana Naam Hare Basya Satguru Maharaj Sahib Ji says that Mera Within my Hira, within my heart Ratana Naam Hare Basya The true Ratan, the true jewel, the true diamond of the Naam, of the name of the Lord of God, of Hari, of that nourisher of the world, Basya has come to abide. And in our Das every day, we ask Sikhanu Sikhidan, Kesdan, Rahadan, Vivekadan, Visahudan, Purusadan, Danna, Sirdan, Namdan. Every day we are asking for this gift of Naam. Satguru Maharaj Sahib Ji, Guru Ram Das Ji is telling us. Guru Amr Das Ji Maharaj blessed me 
The Ratan, the diamond of the name of Hari of the Lord God, Basya has come to abide within my hearer, within my heart, within my soul, with me at all times. And how did this happen? Gore Hat Taryo Mira Matha. When Guru Amardas Ji Maharaj, my true Guru, Taryo placed their hearts, their hand upon Mira Matha, upon my forehead. What does this mean? The placing of the hand upon the forehead, we may ask, how can this happen now with Sri Guru Granth Sahib Ji Maharaj? It happens in exactly the same way. Placing the hand upon the forehead of a Sikh is simply another way of saying Guru Prasad, the grace of the Guru. Guru Ram Das Ji Maharaj is saying it is through the grace of Sri Guru Amar Das Ji and is explaining to us that it will be through the grace of Sri Guru Granth Sahib Ji Maharaj that the name of the Lord will come to abide within our minds as well, within our hearts and souls. Sadhguru Maharaj Sahib Ji is saying, if you're asking for Namdan every day, this is the way of obtaining it. By falling to the feet of the Guru and by being blessed through Guru Prasad, through the grace of the Guru. Guru Amr Das Ji Maharaj graced me, blessed me and blessed me with this diamond of, ne- of the name of the Lord shining within me. And what happens when through Guru Prasad you are blessed with this Naam? Janam Janam Ke Kilbik the kilbik, the sins of Janam Jana of countless lifetimes, and the dukk, the pain of being born and dying again and again in reincarnation, Uttare, all of these things left me. All of my sins fell away through the Naam, through the name of the Lord. All of my pains were eradicated. Guru Naam Dio, when the Guru blessed me with the name of the Lord, Rin Lata, Rin means the debt. Latta means to be removed. The debts were wiped away. All of these sins which had been carried around with me, all of the pains which were results of these sins of many lifetimes, were all wiped out. There were no debts left. There were no accounts left to go through. There was no bad and good. The Guru wiped away all of these with the Naam, with the name of the Lord. And Sadhguru Maharaj Sahib Ji is telling us, O Sikh of the Guru, if you wish for all of your pain to be removed, if you wish to merge in with our Almighty Lord, serve the Guru, and the Guru in His grace will bless you with the Naam, and through the Naam you will be liberated. Mere man, O my mind, paj, meditate, Ram Naam, on the name of Ram, of the name of the Lord Vaheguru, God, who is pervading through all sab artha for everything, all your artha, all of your needs. And another way of interpreting this line, Mere man pajram nam sab artha. Mere man, oh my mind, if you meditate upon the Lord's name, then you will receive everything that you need. Two ways. Any ardas that you have, any prayers that you have, any thoughts that you have in your mind, lay them in front of the Guru. And this line is also telling us, if you lay your thoughts in front of the Guru, the Guru will bless you. Guru Pura Hare Naam Dridaya When the Pura, when the perfect Guru Dridaya implanted the name of Lord within me, when the true Guru graced me and put this name of God within my heart, within my soul, embodied it within me, embedded it inside my soul, Bin Nava Jeevan Birtha those who have been blessed with the name of the Lord, how can you tell what they are like? Guru Sahib Ji says that bin and nave, that they realize without the name of the Lord, jivan and birtha, that life is wasted. Bin and nave, jivan and birtha, without the name of the Lord, they say, Akha jiva If I am repeating, if I am meditating, if I am remembering my Lord God, then it is life for me. If I forget him, then it is like death for me. Akha Jiva, Guru Nanak Dev Ji says, Visra Marjao. And Guru Sahib Ji saying, this is the Nishani, this is the way of telling that the name is embedded, embedded within you. That with the name of the Lord there is life, without the name of the Lord everything is wasted, everything is useless. That is the way when the Guru implants the name within you, that is the feeling, that is the state of life. 
that is the level that those Gurmukhs have attained. Those Guru centered beings that are how Guru Sahib Ji says, pause and think about this. Bin Gur, without the Guru, Mood Paeha Manamuk. We become mood, we become foolish. Why? Because we become Manamuk, mind centered. Those who do not follow the Guru, those who are instead centered upon their own mind, they moho maya neta pata, neta day in, day out. They are entangled in the pata, in the noose around the neck and in the entrapment of the moho, of the attachment to maya, to this world, to this transitory, temporary world, to material goods, to material gain, to the pleasures of this world. Guru Sahib Ji says that the only way of salvation, the only way of liberation is through the Guru. And without the Guru, there is simply only the entanglement of Maya. Then Sadhu Charanana Seve Kabuhu. The mind centered beings have never Seve, have never served. Kabuhu means at any time, not means have not. They have not Seve, they have not served. The Charan, the lotus feet of the Sadhu, the true Guru. Tin Sab Janam Akatha. All of Sab, all of their Janam, all of their life passes Akatha. Akatha means nothing to say about it. There's nothing remarkable. There's nothing to say. When we say nothing remarkable, there's no remark to be made. It's just another wasted life. Gurmukh Laha Lagay, Manimukh Challe. Mool you. It's only remarkable, it's only something to say when someone wins in this life, when someone man jite jag jite, as Guru Nandav says in Jabji Sahib, someone who wins over their mind and wins the world. Then we can look at their life and say, Gur Sikha Sabas Janam Sawariya. As Pai Gurdas Ji says, in their vara, the Gursikha, those Sikhs of the Gurus who have Savariya, who have completely devoted their lives to the Lord, decorated themselves with the name of God, Shabas, they are great, they are all hell to them. And if not, then another life just passes away without any meaning. Jin Sadhu Charan Sadh Pag Seve, Guru Sahib Ji says, Jin, those people, those Guru centered beings, those Sadhus, those holy beings, who have seve, who have served the charan, the lotus feet, the pug, the lotus feet of the guru, of the true sadhu of all sadhu, the saint of all saints, those who have attached themselves to the name of the Lord, which is the lotus feet of the guru, the name of God, then saplio janam sanatha, their janam is saplio, their life on this earth is completely fulfilled sanatha and sanatha means to be liberated they are liberated and sanatha means they have a nath they have a master lord god always above them they always have that master they are not masterless they are not orphaned they have their mother and father vaheguru always standing with them mokau ki jai das das dasan ko O oh, Vaheguru Ji, Mokau, make me, Kija means to make me, the slave of those people who, with their mind, are your Das, are your servants, serve you with their mind, Das, who serve you with their Bani, with their words, Dasanko, and with their Sarir, with their body, who serve you. Make me the servant of those people. And Guru Sahib Ji says, Mokau, Kija, Das, Das, Dasanko, make me the servant of your servants. O Vaheguru Ji, the slave of the slave of your servants. Nanak te mukh ujjale keti shutti naal. The servant of the servant of your servants, O Vaheguru, those who serve you, their servants, servants may I become. Even they are blessed. Just as the fragrance of the sandal, sandalwood goes throughout the whole jungle, in the same way the fragrance of Nam, 
pervades through all of them who do Sangat. Kiti Shuti Nal, all of those who are Nal, who are with them, are also liberated. Har Dayata Har Jagannatha, O Jagannatha, O Natha, Natha means master of this Jagann, of this world. Tar, please bless me with your Daya, with your grace, O Hari, O Vahiguru. Make me the slave of the slave of your slaves. The slave of those who serve you with their mind, words and with their body. Ham antule gyan heen agyani. This is the way of doing ardas in front of the Guru. Vaheguru Ji, Guru Sahib Ji, I am antule, I am blind. What am I blinded with? Gyan heen, because I don't have the eyes of prem and sharda, the eyes of love and devotion. I don't have gyan, I don't have any wisdom of your spiritual knowledge. Agyani, I am completely without this in the darkness. How can I walk upon this marag, this pantha, this path to you, O God? To this blind soul being, O Guru, please bless me with your anchal, with the hem of your robe, with grasping onto your robe. And this is the way of meeting the Lord, grasping onto the robe of the Guru, grasping onto the robe of the Master of Siddhi Guru Granth Sahib Ji Maharaj. But first we have to accept, first we have to acknowledge that we are under, that we are blind, that we don't have the knowledge. That is one of the hardest things to do, to fall in front of the Guru, to sacrifice all to the Guru and to say, Guru Sahib Ji, I have no power, I have no wisdom and I have no strength. And only then can you glom, grasp onto the robe of the Guru. That's what Guru Sahib Ji is telling us. Ham andale kaugur anchal dijay. Please bless me with the hem of your robe, O Guru Sahib Ji. Jana nanak chalaha malantha. Then Satguru Ram Das Ji Maharaj says that your servant chalaha can walk along milantha onto the path which unites me with you. So in this Shabbat today, Satguru Maharaj Sahib Ji is talking about those Guru-centered beings. How are they blessed with the Naam? Through the Guru Prasad, through the grace of the Guru. How are we going to obtain the grace of the Guru? By falling at the feet of the Guru. By accepting that we are in darkness. By accepting that there is no other path. And Guru Sahib Ji shown us there is no other path without the Guru. Bin Guru Mood Pae Hai Manamuk. There is only the Patha, the entanglement of the Moho of Maya, the attachment of Maya, of this illusion. And may our Ardas be on this day that we become Moko Ki Jai Das Das Dasan Ko. The servants of the servants of your servants, O Lord God Vaheguru. Ham andale gyan hini agyani, kyaun challa hamar gpantha. Ham andale kau guri anchal di jai, jan nanak challa hamilantha. Vaheguru ji ka khalsa, Vaheguru ji ki fateh.